right, here we are back. It is day 52. It is 2200, 10 o'clock. So we just finished doing Nabis Game Corrections. And what an adventure that was. Still feel a little traumatized from it, I think. <laughs> oh, sure. Pack me in that a box was, like your other old things. That was really something. Let's see. All right. Uh, oh, yeah, we are going to pack you in the box there, Lister Drone, because guess what? We now have a tier five or six drone. Where did it go? We found one in the main loot. There it is, tier six. Yeah, we've got a tier six drone that we found in the main loot of Navis Game Corrections. So that was a pretty good find there. Let's do a repair on it just so we got a fresh start. And does that actually give us anything other than more durability? Give us more storage or anything like that? Let's find Power out. up complete. I don't think it does. No. Kind of thinking it didn't. Stay here. Enter code. Unlock. Talk. Quiet mode. All right. Where are you taking me? Now. At least you got less of an attitude than the tier three one. That's nice. All right. So we got some stuff to throw in the cell cabinet here. We got four awesome sauces. We need to get some sugar butts. And then eventually we will be able to sell a bunch of this stuff. Let's see, we got rock busters, jailbreakers, nerd tats. So that's for mining. Next time we go mining, we need to use the rock busters. All right. Um, not seeing sugar butts though, so we'll go with that. Okay. All right. So we now have tier six, a bunch of tier six weapons, even a desert vulture, which is better than our tier five. So we need to swap that out too. All right. Get our mods off. Tier six is already repaired. All we gotta do is modify it. Put them on there. Nice. Now we got 133.7 even with the silencer. 138.2 without it. Okay. Put our tier five in here. Okay, we got repair kits and lock picks. We need to get a couple more there just to have, make sure we're covered. Okay, we got our drone and our vehicle. Be nice to get some mods for the drone eventually. Okay, all of our weapons are in good shape. The SMG needs repair soon. Let's just go ahead and do it. We're getting pretty close. Close enough. All right. Make sure everything's loaded. Just because we can. Better now than later in the middle of a fight. <laughs> All right, let's go back in here. Okay, we got a tier six stun baton. Tier six desert vulture, tier six M60. Okay, we got a tier five SMG and a tier five or tier four assault rifle. Got a tier six sniper rifle, double barrel, 44, pipe machine gun, and pipe baton. That's only 18 still. That's only 37. That's 80, 13.9. 
145. We got a tier three SMG. We got a tier four pistol and lever action. That needs to go over in robotics. We got a tier two AK. And we've got jailbreakers here. So I need to move over here. Okay. That needs to go there. Okay. All right, now <clears throat> so we need to go cook this stuff here for tomorrow. Looking pretty good on everything. We can put the beaker on the campfire and also cook water, although we don't really need it too bad. Well, I guess we do need some. Oh, hold on. Forgot. Drinks are over here. We'll still go ahead and do that. And we've got drinks in here that need to go over there. I dumped out the loot a little too quick on the last video because it was such a long video. Crazy long for Navis Gun Corrections. Crazy long. And this probably needs to go in meds along with these other things over here. Sugar butts. Oh, we do got sugar butts. Okay. How did I miss that? All right, we're going to put those over here in the cell container. We get two more sugar butts. We can use that and the awesome sauce to get 30% when we get ready to sell all this stuff up here. So that'll be awesome. Good. We're in good shape there. Okay. And we also have beer, which we're going to try to take on our next tier six job. Tier six infestation are serious jobs. <laughs> All right. Um, I think that's where we're at. Let's see. Do we get any points? Nope. We didn't get any points out of the end of the job there. Our next one is... The Last Sunset Nursing Home, Tier 6 Infestation. I believe the last time we did that was Standard Tier 5 Fetch and Clear. So now we're going to do the same one, Tier 6 Infestation. That should be interesting. One thing I've definitely learned is we would have never made it through Napa's Game Corrections Tier 6 Infestation without the M60. So... That was a big help. And we also, we need to look at making a bunch of ammo for our turret here. So I'm going to go upstairs, cook the stuff and look at making that ammo and see what else we can craft. I'll go ahead and pause the video and we'll pick it back up in the morning. All right, let's go see what we got up here, I believe. Got some robotic ammo made or making. Not sure if it's finished. Let's see what we got here. Okay, it did finish. 841 rounds. Let's see. Do we got more lead? A little bit. I'm considering going and spending some time in the desert. And if so, it'll be nice to take uh, this turret with us with a bunch of ammo. And I was also looking at making the drone. The armor plating is the only one we can actually make. I don't know if we really even need to. 
by a board steel, I think, is what we don't have. And what I think, I'm not going to take the time to make. I need iron and clay. Let's see. It's only five board steel. That's not too bad. Um, I don't think we really need the armor plating on that thing. No, it's not going to take too long. Maybe we'll just do it. All right, got 871 ammo for the turret. Guess we better take plenty of food with us. And water, particularly water, probably. And let's we'll see how our ammo is looking. Food, water. Okay, we got extra food there. Cooking, but we don't need it probably. Let's see, there's our five of those. Let's track this. Since it costs so little, I'm going to do it just because. Don't think we need it. But, what the heck. Five steel, forged steel was the most expensive part, and that's not a huge deal. There we go. Can't get the uh, cargo mod for it or the medical mod for it yet, so. Um, actually, yeah, I guess it will be good to get this one. It helps the de degradation on it don't degrade as fast so we won't have to repair it as often so yeah that'll help for the time being yeah we don't have anything going on over here I guess the only thing we might want to do is check the tower and make sure it's ready because if we come back, oh, we need more iron in there. Let's see. Let's see if we got some iron downstairs. We want to make sure that horde base is ready. If we have to come rushing back for horde night. We don't want to have to make repairs on it when we get back in case we cut it close as usual on the timing. There we go. Let all that stuff burn and cook down. Okay, I had to pause there for a second and I actually went and ate dinner. Just pause the recording. So, all right, we got our mod for the drone. And I was actually thinking about it. And yeah, um, since we've done a couple of tier sixes now, one of them was actually the Navis Gang Corrections, which I really wanted to do. So we did Tier 6 Infestation. And they take so long that I'm thinking... Uh, that's just too long for making the videos. And, man, they're pretty tiring for me to do. Now, we've done a couple, I believe, what instead of, we're, instead of just continuing to... To do these and take forever to do them 
is um, take a vacation to the desert and go spend some time there and do a bunch of missions over there and even just do the lower tiers and supposedly they get better rewards and things anyway so we're going to remove that quest and we'll do the treasure map on our way out hopefully it's going in the right direction and I'm thinking oh looks like it's south we need to go west let's see how far it is it's not too far it won't be a big deal you know we can just go south grab it and then head straight west and we also could go spend time in one of these other cities and work for one of the other traders for a little bit. Maybe we'll do that instead of the desert. I was thinking desert because we've now got the M60 and really good weapons all modded up and whatnot. We could handle the desert, no problem, at least on the lower tiers. But maybe instead of that, maybe we'll just go visit one of these other cities and spend a couple of days there. And we're gonna to have to come back here anyway for Horde Nights because that's where our tower is, unless we decide to build a new tower somewhere. Um, I wouldn't want to build it too close. If anything, probably build it, yeah, in one of these desert cities, maybe. I don't know which one. That way we kind of have a, a horde tower over here, and then one over here in case we're over in this area more so when it comes toward night. I don't think there's too many. This is pretty close to the edge of the map, so probably not more cities that way necessarily. And I believe the snow biome is down here. We hit part of it there, and then the wasteland's over here. I don't think the snow biome's very big. So something more centralized would be good. This one's more so just on the eastern side of the map. That's more western, let's see. So what would be kind of centralized? Oh, maybe uh, maybe this little town right here. Or is that a big city? I think that's a smaller city. We could always do a, a horde tower in this city. That would probably be a good spot. That's pretty centralized on the map. And if we ever get down into the wasteland, it'll be, um, yeah, not quite as far as going all the way up there. Depending on if you're in the wasteland east or west. If you're over here, it'd probably be just fine to go up there. If you're in the wasteland over here, or the desert particularly, then this would be much closer here. So I think instead of going, maybe instead of going to the desert, we'll just go up here and visit this town up here for a little bit and see what they have to offer. Maybe we can go west from there and see if there's anything over in that area later. And then head down to the desert or cut through here and head to the desert. This is Trader Joel, Trader Wrecked, and we've been doing Trader Q. So we got two traders, and we've got Trader Bob down here in the wasteland. And let's see, Trader Joel in the desert there. So I'm thinking we'll go up here and uh, hang around this city up here for a little bit and do some jobs for Trader Joel and see what POIs up here may be different because in this city we've pretty much got the the main ones. We've done Deshong Tower, we've done Vanity Tower, and Navs Gang Corrections. Um, I don't even know what a bunch of good ones, a bunch of bit or a bunch of big ones and good ones. This nursing home, ostrich hotel. That was a good one. Not too big, luckily. So what time we got here? 947. We got plenty of time. Go grab this treasure map. Let's see about putting this mod on our drone. Okay, he's got health, durability 600. And let's see what that, that didn't really change it. I guess the durability just runs down half as fast, so that'll be good. 
We don't have to worry as much about him having to be repaired all the time. And we've still got four slots, so we can do we could do two storage slots and then a medical one if we wanted to. Or three storage slots to have a lot of storage. That sure takes a lot of time to organize all that storage. Okay. So, all right, we got our turret ammo. Um, we take the sledge or just go ahead and take, take this guy or take both. Let's take both. No way, if we run out of ammo for this one, we can use the sledge. We can just leave them in the in the truck. <clears throat> and we got plenty of ammo. Let's take one more stack of 7.62 maybe. And we'll have two shotgun, two 7.62, one magnum, one 9mm. Let's do two 9mm. The Magnum and the shotgun, you go through less speedily than the machine guns. So that's 300 of each of those, 600 and 300 of that. Let's do one more of those just for good measure. Okay, all of our weapons are repaired and in good shape. Prepare our hammer, axe, whatever that thing is. <clears throat> okay. Um, we probably should take a little more repair kits. Where did we put those? Take a few more of those. And lock picks. Yeah, we'll take a few more lock picks. We hit safes. We can always come back down here for these supplies if we need them. We've got a stack of 10 steaks at least, and then we got a couple of canned foods and 11 waters and <clears throat> five corn. That'd definitely be enough to get us through until we can find more stuff over there. Probably more than enough. And if we've forgotten anything, we are just going, okay, that way to this treasure. Forgotten anything? We'll just either have to acquire it over there. We need gas. I'm thinking we take more gas. We'll just have to either come back or acquire it over there. So, all right, how much gas do we take? We'll just go ahead and take the full thing. We don't have to worry about it for a little while. We can go ahead and put the gas. Some of this extra ammo, food, and drinks on there, put that on there, that, there we go, and we'll be, all right, we've got, uh, and we could probably take the pickaxe, if we end up having to do some mining or something, that'll be good to have, don't want to take the auger, Uses gas, makes too much noise. We probably need to sell a shovel. Okay, we got wood. Okay. Uh, let's just go with that. Only really be so ready without uh, forgetting something. Whoa! <laughs> All right, that was crazy. Just can get out of here without running through the lake or something. Is there a hole right there? Yeah. There's going to be a hole right here. Watch this. Oh. There goes one of our repair kits. You gotta be kidding me. We got stuck in this thing, young thing. This open. All right. All right, we got to calm down. Before we destroy our vehicle. Sure did get dark all of a sudden. Try 
I would like to have that supercharger mod. Was that nitrate we just ran over and broke? It was weird. Never done that before. 39% of our vehicle. We just about destroyed it in one small trip. <laughs> there goes the repair kit. All right, stop truck. All right. Awfully close to this POI over here. Looking to get stocked up on clay. Just do it. We need it. kind of in the center of the circle here. That's the center is more right here. 500 play already. It's not too shabby. Yep, we can also use that robotic turret to watch our back when we're mining, things like that. Okay, I think it's about time to start digging down a little. Had real good luck just digging shallow for the first part of it and only dig down at the end. You don't end up with a huge deep hole to try to crawl out of. Oh, I see it. See what we're going to get. Nice, first try. Ammo, four level four shotgun, more diamonds. All right, pretty good. All right, now we just need to plot a course up here. We'll just do a quick waypoint to have something to aim at. More nitrate right there. 3.8 kilometers. If we can do it without crashing this time. Avoid those fences would be nice. What is this place? Is that the theater? Yep, that's the theater, the drive-in, I think. No. No. Oh, yeah, yeah. It is. I've been through and raided the drive-in, but I've never done it as an actual job. Not sure what tier that one is. It looks like the Shong Tower straight ahead there. Okay, we need to start heading over this way, I guess. John Tower was another one that took two days. There goes Navasgain High School. That one took quite a while. I think I did it in one day, though. Almost got it for rabbit. Uh-oh. Watch 
Hotel for those fences. Oh. Okay. There we go, 1.6 kilometers. We're halfway there. Hogs Hiller Ranch. That one's fun. You definitely have to find a way to get up high so you can cheese him. Try to fight him face to face on the ground. You're probably not going to make it. Maybe with the M60. Okay, we're going to get there pretty quick. Yeah, I've got the extended fuel tank mod for the vehicles, but I tend not to use it because if you switch vehicles, you don't get your gas back out of it. Maybe we should check out this cop car. All right, maybe we'll get it first time. Nice, no, we're saving a lot of lock picks with that. We must have it exactly what we need. Into the lock picking perk. That's full of crawlers out there. All right, which way do we go? This way? Way station. Never done that one. Let's see, where are we at? Oh, we're, okay, we're up there. That is a good place for a waste station. You gotta give it to the game makers on that one on their world creation. It was really good. Got some lead. Which are hard to see sometimes. I know we're rolling back. I wish this thing kind of wish this thing had a heart parking brake on it. Actually on this computer, I can see the blue dot for the lead pretty good. And on my other playthrough, I'm playing on my laptop. I play in the evenings. I don't usually video except for the board nights. You'll see the ones that says no commentary. That's the ones I've done on that playthrough. On my laptop. And the problem with that is, on the laptop, with I guess with the screen, even though it's a 17 inch, it is hard to see. Uh -huh. It's hard to see the blue dots on there for some reason. The black dots are good. The copper colored dots are good for the iron, the rock, all of them. But the, the blue ones, for whatever reason, are just really hard to see. All right, we got a crack a book right here. We could probably clear this place and use it for like a home base in this city. We're not near the city center or anything like that, but usually the traders aren't, so use it for a temporary uh, place to stay at night where it's safe. Um, don't, we don't have a sleeping bag with us. I have to make one. It's no big deal. Let's go see this trader and see what's up. We haven't uh, searched up this trader stuff. We'll do that right quick. Three o'clock. We got plenty of time. We'll loot his compound. Don't care about any of that stuff. We'll definitely take all the gas we can get. 
I don't think there's anything over here. The work stations are all right around through here. Okay, seven steel. That's forged steel. That's pretty good. Coal and gunpowder. We'll take it. What's in this red car? We'll take the Dukes. We'll take the corn seed for now. Not a big deal, though. Okay. Oh. Now that's what I'm talking about. A free crucible. Nice. And a little bit of cement. And we'll drop the blueberries and take the cement. Concrete mix. Raffle parts. A couple of books we can sell. All right. I think that's it. Can't get in here. And there's some books in there. Let's go see what he has for jobs. Sell a couple of these magazines to him. What's that tone you're singing? No, oh, hold on. Turn off my headlamp. Blinds you when you do that. Okay, tier one. Clear zombies. Two seventy-five. A little predicament. Reed's oh, residence. Yeah, I don't know if I've done that one before. Thank you. I bet you wouldn't do this for just anyone. I sure wouldn't. Land. You're lucky. Would you? Sell that. Sell that. Yeah, we didn't bring any money with us, so I guess we need to sell a few things. <laughs> uh, sell that. Sell that. Sell that. And sell that. Okay, I'll get us started on our money a little bit. And I thank you, kind sir. You're welcome. We'll be back in just a little bit to collect our pay, okay? 3.30. Well, our current set of weapons and whatnot. We should be able to knock out a tier one job easily today. We want to also clear this building so we have somewhere to spend the night. Let's see how far is that one? 283 right over there. It's the best way to get there. Not this way. Alright, let's go to state on the road. It looks like it's up here. That's one way to take care of a zombie. Okay, here we go. That was the Reed residence. So it's a house. It'll be right over here. That's true. You know what? I just realized that too. Is uh, we have got a bunch of mailboxes to be checking in the city. Okay, we'll park right there. No coal. Bring your mailbox over here. All right, lady. You're in trouble. Because we just got here, and we're not here to play games. now. Look out. Take that. What do we get? Skill points. Nice. We'll take it. We'll take that uh, murky water. Okay. I forgot to unload them to the truck. Luckily it's right here.
Okay, and murky water too. And uh, we don't need this turret. Let's move him up here with our other stuff. We'll keep our stuff, our keep stuff up at the top here. Grass. Okay. I would think tier one, we should be able to run through it with basically only the stun behind. Pretty quick. Be a lot quicker if we don't loot every little thing. Although we just got a beer there. We would have missed. Oh! Radiated. Actually, you know, I guess maybe I was wrong because even though they're tier one, our game stage, I guess, is high enough now that it's going to make higher for harder zombies be in these either way. But at least tier one should be a lot less of them. We should be able to handle. Hopefully. <laughs> Five thirty, so I'm gonna have to sort of hurry. Try to get back by five and get our residence secured for tonight. I'd rather do that during the day when we're not runners. Pretty nice when you can jump on them and get them before they can even get up off the ground. Okay. Yeah, that had some grass in it or something looked like. That was good. Anything else? That's locked. Came from down there. Okay. Like we're going up to the attic. First thing. Whoa! Just remember him. Pretty handily. Blue lock picks. I'd like to shovel all these pallets and stuff, but uh, in this job we're. In a little bit of a hurry. Oh, he snuck up behind me. Okay, is this the main loop? Okay, we can do without that and that. And that. And that. We'll use that. Keep that. That, we can read that. Blueberry seeds, nope, no mushroom seeds. Or some of the stuff we could sell, probably. And we will definitely take. Okay. Oh, we finished it, return to trader. Okay, I guess that was it. Didn't even fire a bullet. Not a single bullet. Okay, got a few things to sell. A few books to read. That's the end of this one. That was that. Yep. There's the mailbox. And we can read this. Put that. Oops, there's more than one. Put that there to sell. Anything else to read? Nope, just to sell. Where's our car? Okay. 
Okay, 639. We have got time to go back, get our pay, our first job over here, and we'll secure that uh, crack a book next door to the trader. We'll spend the night there. enough time to do that probably you need assistance it must be my lucky day Thank all right you. what have we got here we go. blue we'll go with uh-oh guess what we have to sell stuff first now we're cooking with gas uh it's not gonna let it oh there we go Let's see buy that 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 that, 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 what else, that's good enough, shotgun parts, since we're on this side of town we can't store this stuff, we'll uh, sell more than we normally do probably. You buy a spring? Yep. All right. I think that'll be sufficient. It's been a real gratitude. Now, let's see. Let's do the magazines, I guess. Pipe bombs will be good. But for now, we're going to do that. We'll get a job for tomorrow. Here, one clear zombies. Can you help me with my problem? Richmond residence. Brilliant. I guess this kind of makes us friends now. Go clear that uh, crack a book for tonight. truck right here. This open. Starting with books already. Two. Nice. Is that a vulture? What are you doing? Whoa. That was a pretty pretty lucky shot right there. That was a quick shot. Okay. Okay, cash register, nice. We sent a greater chance of knocking down the target. Arrows. Assault rifles crafting. We need to dump our inventory again here. There for now. We gotta get this one knocked out. Pretty quick. We got eight o'clock now so we'll just pick up everything sort through it later It'll give us something to do tonight we'll come back through if there's any books we missed tonight may need to may have to secure a room here. This place is a 
a lot more tore up than I thought it was. Okay, maybe up here. Oh, not this room. Well, I guess vultures would be the only thing that I have to worry about. I guess we could spend the night anywhere here, actually. There's not too many zombies in here, apparently. Which is good, I guess. had so many cooking pots and grill grates I just realized we probably should have just uh, brought one with us is that it? Is that the whole place? we're done? we make a ladder and get up on the roof if we wanted to I think that was the whole thing Yep. Not the most secure uh, place to spend the night. <laughs> any of uh, any of them that come roaming by are gonna easily walk right into this place. Loot out the rest of it completely, I guess, and uh, I'm sure we didn't miss any books here. Pretty small crack of book, but better than nothing. What is this door? Nothing back here. We already got that. Employees must wash hands. We got a wrench with us. How is miss it. I'm 15. Can we wrench the cash register? Yep. And the cup? Yep. Well, reach this. There's a bag up there. Almost missed that. Take that. Got some wood. Easy wood. Well, that's about it, really. Look at that. Just to let you folks know the Put this back on the truck. Take the easy pickings. We could probably drive around all night and loot mailboxes or something, but we'd be burning up a bunch of gas to do that. Thing here we want to sell. I don't have a sell price. We can scrap it. Okay. Okay, we do got a grate. Just need a. Uh, we could let's see. Do we got anything we need to cook? Then we get some corn. No. Trader Joe's is now closed. Okay. We got a few books there. That's nice. All right, well, we're at 54 minutes on this video anyway, so we'll just go up here, grab us a bedroom. Oops. Fell off. We'll grab us a bedroom right up here. Close that door. 
Which bedroom do we want? We want to sleep in the kitchen. Or sleep in the bedroom with a door with no ceiling, no roof. We can stand right here and watch the zombies roam around tonight. Oh, there they are already. Get our rifle and take a closer look at them. Get the right one with the scope. There we go. Okay. Got a working stiff over there. A salvage place over there. That might be fun to loot. All right, let's take a look at these magazines right quick. A medical. Another vehicle. Three, two or three steroids. Okay. Two armors. And sledgehammer. All right, because we're at 56 minutes, we'll just call it, call it on this video. I appreciate you watching, and we'll see you on the next one.